Hi everyone, it's Rajit again with One Illumined Heart. Thank you so much for joining me here today. Uh, this is going to be the first of four videos that I'm doing regarding uh, 5D and some of the components of 5D, as in the counterbalancing negativity of other human beings, uh, 5D communities that are going to be set up, etc. So we're going to do the first one. It's on counterbalancing negativity. So these videos are going to be short so that you can listen quickly to each idea with things enumerated. I'm going to put my glasses on so I can read what I've written to keep things really accurate for you. So this is really exciting that you as a light worker, you as a person who's holding love, whether you're a star seed or a light worker or a person who wants to move into that direction, that every spiritual frequency level that you hold that is above a seven has the ability to counterbalance negativity of other human beings on the planet. So let's start with um, the power that you have as an individual to create change just by holding the energy of love, of greater awakening. So here we go. Most of humanity, as we know, we, I said this in another video, I was told that about 68% of humanity is between 5.0 and 7.0 spiritual frequency. So that is not very high, by the way. That's very low level. There's a few people underneath that, and those are people who are really, really, really dark, really, really asleep, really have nefarious intent um, in the world on a personal level, or a community level, or a global level, whatever their intent is, is not good. <laughs> uh, a lot of people between five and seven also hold those same um, possibilities, as well as those between five and seven hold the possibility of doing greater good. Some of them are just awakening. They're new to human bodies, and um, some who are new are already highly elevated because that's how they chose to come in. So let's talk about those who are now getting beyond 7.0. So if you are a 7.0 to 7.9 spiritual frequency, in that range, you have the ability to do the counterbalancing of the negativity of others for 1 to 50 people. So the higher you up you go, the more you are able to counterbalance the negativity. Of course, if you're having a really off day yourself, you may not be able to counterbalance the negativity of others quite as well. Um, so that's, that's between 7.0 and 7.9. Now it gets really exciting. When you get to the eighth level, where you're really beginning to awaken, really starting to listen to your intuition, and really becoming more sensitive to what's around you, the people around you, how you're affecting others as well as how others are affecting you. Between 8.0 and 8.9, you can counterbalance the negativity of 600 to 620 people. And that is as long as you're not sick yourself, um, where you have to take care of yourself. You're not gonna be giving any energy away. But other, other than that, you are able to do that. Uh, if you are a 9.0 to a 9.9, .9, you have the capacity to go up to 2,000 people that you can counterbalance the negativity of. Again, it depends on your physical strength at the moment in time. Your emotional and mental state will also have an impact on how much you can change the environment uh, of energetically of the people around you. Um, and send out this love vibe, you know, the proverbial pebble in the pond idea that when you're holding a particular frequency, then that goes out into the world. Okay, when you are in 10th spiritual level of frequency, 10.0 to 10.9, remember that is the level that you can begin also to co-create your crystalline body by doing it with a special diet, with meditation, with prayers, with chanting, with devotion to the divine or source in whatever way you want. But 10.0 to 10.9, you can counterbalance up to 4,300 people. This is a huge impact you can have on your family life, on your community life, on the global energy of the planet, on your national uh, impact by 
holding your truth, your love, your voice, to spread human kindness, to spread love, working together with other people to create community, working toward common goals for the common good. That's where all of that energy starts to really ramp up quite a bit. Then when you get up to 11.0 and 11.9, your awareness and awakening just is just so much more um, profound. It has a huge, much more huge impact. Um, that is 5,530 people up to that. And again, according to how you are physically or your state of mind, that will have an impact. But that is the possibility. Between 12.0 and 12.9, it's 6,000 people. Between 13.0 and 13.9, getting up there in frequency, is 7,300 people, 7,300. And between 4.0 and 4.9, 8,700 people. So that's an amazing positive impact that each of us, as we move up in our spiritual journey, can have on the impact of our communities and uh, the globe. Because every positive thought, every thought of love, every thought of positive co-creation and working together is this beautiful ripple effect out into the world. So here we want to talk a little bit about you taking charge of what kind of an impact you as a human being want to have in the world. As you can see by this counterbalancing negativity numbers, the possibility is huge. What part do you want to take in being the best you that you can be, sharing the love that you have inside of you, sharing your creativity with others, sharing the willingness to work together to create common good for the greater whole of everyone concerned instead of just me, 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 I, 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 and how much money can I make and how much status can I get and how much greed can I have, uh, how much power can I have over others. Instead, let's work together, use this empowerment of self-empowerment and helping others to become empowered as well. So that's the end of this particular video on counterbalancing the negativity in the world around you by holding the frequency that you are able to hold. If you have any questions about this, feel free to contact me uh, at info at oneillumined.heart.com. It will be in the information below the video. And uh, feel free to find out if what frequency you are. Um, and if you want to donate to the cause of the work that I'm doing right now, uh, we are happy to have you do that as well. I'm going to create a, a Patreon account for you to be able to do that. Or um, you can let me know how you want to contribute in whatever way is wonderful. All right. Take good care. Blessings. Bye-bye.